Hey guys, this is Jake from the FPV Academy channel in partnership with GetFPV.com. Today I have a very special video. Uh, we will be unboxing the High Singy Quadcopter and I'll actually be having my daughter do most of the unboxing and most of this review. So just a little bit of background, she has never flown FPV before. She's always shown an interest in what I'm doing whenever I'm working on the quads, but she doesn't have any experience flying. She spent maybe 30 minutes on the liftoff FPV sim in the past. So this, I believe, would be a great way to see whether somebody with zero experience in the past can learn to fly FPV pretty much in one day using this high singing quadcopter. So she's six years old and let's see if we can get her to fly the quad today. So this is Amelia. She's gonna be helping us with this unboxing today. She has no idea what this video is about or what's inside of this box. She has no clue. So let's see what her reaction is when she sees it and we'll take it from there. So what do you think is inside of it? I don't know, so I wanna see what's inside. You don't know? Okay, well let's open it and have a look what we can find inside. There's a picture on it. What does that look like? A drone. A drone for? Racing. And do you think it's for adults or do you think it's for kids? Kids. Kids or adults. Both people can fly it. Mm. So let's open this up. Now just a quick disclaimer. I'm jumping back from having already done a little bit of the quad. This is not a full review on the quad. If you want to see a full review, Joshua Bolwell made an amazing video. It goes in depth on the tech on the quad who it's best for and a whole lot of other really cool things. This is more a first-hand experience seeing what it's like for someone like Amelia to fly a quadcopter for the first time. It's kind of the experience that you could expect if you did purchase this for your um, child or for yourself. Let's see what we get inside. So just a disclaimer, this has been sent by GetFPV for review. Um, we were sent a review model I'm not sure whether this is a brand new one or whether this is the one that they got for review. So this may have been opened before, um, but at, at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter. We still have the drone and all the equipment. So let's see what else is in there. There's a welcome. And then what do we have here? These are... the like batteries. Yep, they are the batteries. Cool. So, how many batteries do we get? Um, four. Four batteries. Let's put that aside. And let's see what's in here. So these are... More batteries. More batteries. So let's put those aside. And I think this is a bag where you can put stuff in. It's just a little high semi bag. And here we have the drone. the drone. So let's pull this out. So what do you think of this? I like it. You like it? Mm -hmm. Well, this may or may not have been used. I'm not too sure. Maybe it hasn't, but this uh, camera sticker is still on there. So, so it looks let's... like it hasn't been here. Yeah, maybe not. So let's take that off. And the props also look pretty much brand new so I don't think it has been used so this is the drone and then over here we have the radio and over here we have what is this I think oh the goggles the goggles yeah I don't think this one has been opened this if you look at even the goggles still has this on it so yeah thank you get it for sending an unopened version of this and then there's also a big manual inside of this and yeah there's lots of information in here but we won't be going through all that right now we will in a bit let's see what else we get so this is a box full of accessories let's see what is in some of this accessory box so this is our head strap. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think that makes it pretty clear that I don't think this has been used. If you look at the head strap is um, unopened. Yeah. So we'll open that and we'll put that on. And over here we have more faceplate just to help with light making. 
Are you excited? Yeah. Very excited. Okay, so let's have a look. The amazing thing with the high singing is that you get the app. And with the app, it allows you to do a lot of really cool things. I personally haven't looked at a lot of reviews on the high singing, so this will all be new for me as well. Um, so let's download the app and see what happens. Okay, so here we have the high singing app. I would need to sign up. So I'm signing up to the high singing app. Uh, just one note, the confirmation email did go into the spam box, so just check your spam. So now we need to add items. So scan QR code to add new items to inventory. So this came with the Stargazer and let's use this to scan real quick. There we go. So now we should have all of our items on here. So as you can see, we don't have any airtime or any flights and zero crashes. That's interesting. And yep, your journey starts here. This is our first journey into flying this little FPV drone. So, Amelia, let's see if we can get this started up. I'm gonna put this battery in and we'll see if we can get this going. <laughs> makes a little sound and look it's got lights on the back and yeah. um, okay so we just found the battery charger which will allow us to charge all four batteries at once which is amazing that definitely helps I'm not sure what the flight time on this would be but it's really convenient to be able to plug in all of the batteries in one go and charge all of them and along with the batteries that we found we also found a sticker pack. So while these batteries are busy charging, Amelia will be putting some stickers on her high singing drone and we'll do a quick time lapse of that happening. So let's just do a quick indoor flight and see if everything is working before we take it outside and actually try and fly it for the first time. So Amelia, what I want you to do is just see if you can get this going. So this button at the bottom is to start the engine. This one is to fly up, this one is to fly down, and this one is to move sideways. So if you go too high and the wind takes it, just bring this one down. Okay. Okay. So hold that middle button. So the engine starts. Yep, that's it. And then first go up, don't go on that one yet, just go straight up first. Okay. <laughs> so that was really good. Let's take it outside and see what we can do with it outside. Okay. Are you ready to try and fly it for the first time, Ems? Sorry, don't you this one? Did you plug the battery in? I don't think the battery's plugged in. Oh. There we go. So it'll flash when the battery's ready. And then when you are ready, you can go. Can I? Yep, press it. It's okay, it's okay. So it's facing towards you. All right. So right stick forward, right stick forward. Yeah. Okay. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Okay. It just shows how durable it is. There we go. <laughs> how, how was that? Good, for my first flight at least. What do you think? I think it was good. Was it tricky? Yeah, it was tricky. Yeah, that was your first time flying line of sight, right? Yeah. So, did you want to try with the goggles on? Yeah. I think you should try it with the goggles on. So let's just switch these on and make sure that we have signal. So, goggles are going on. And we have signal. 
Is that comfy? Can you see okay? Okay, let's see if this goes better. Don't go too high. Careful, we don't want to go over the roof. <laughs> it's okay, go forward, go forward. On the right stick. It's the same as on the simulator, love. There we go. What's wrong? It's okay, you're just going down onto the grass. Go up a little bit. It's okay. It has landed. Did it land? Is it harder with the goggles? Yeah. Okay. We're going to keep flying today and we'll make another video a little bit later to see your progress. Uh-huh. Okay, so Mila's been flying a little bit more today and she's finally able to fly FPV all by herself fairly proficiently. So this is a great beginner drone for sure. Let's see if like So Amelia just finished her first FPV flight. I think it was really successful. Um, look, this is 100% a beginner drone. This isn't really for somebody looking to advance into bigger FPV drones such as this. I wouldn't really recommend, you know, if you want to fly these ultimately, I would not recommend getting this. However, if you want a toy to play around in the house and just have a lot of fun with, this is the way to go. Like, she was amazing on the drone after a few batteries i think she probably flew about six seven eight batteries before we filmed that uh, last video now and i think you did amazing i mean what did you think did you enjoy it yeah was it fun yes yeah with a little bit of practice she'd be able to fly this indoors as well um i'll be doing a quick battery indoors as she said guys what you can do with this because it is really fun and yeah i hope you enjoyed this video again this isn't really a review video this is more just to show what you can do with this, the skill level you can get up to after one day and just how younger kids can really enjoy this as a toy. Thank you for watching and we'll catch you in the next one. Line under the table. <laughs> Dad, under this chair tunnel. Chair tunnel. Looks sideways to me. <laughs> oh, he went underneath the chair. I don't think that's a thing. Mommy, what? Yeah! There it is! <laughs> Good 
Santa going through the hallway, Dada. Show us around the, the house, Dada. Yeah, around the house. This just screams hard. Ha! Huh. Keep doing it. Here he comes, here he comes! <laughs> <laughs> Is that it? Outside, yeah. 